So you may already know that one of my favorite combos is a uh, cream real screamer and a lazy man hook. Um, I started fishing these about a, a year ago and gosh I fell in love with them. I've caught so many fish in so many different situations. Um, these things are extremely weedless so I was thinking the other day well what's what's better than one? How about five of them? Hey guys, this is John Fitch, and uh, you've probably seen some of my other shows on uh, on these Lazy Man hooks here. You know, pretty much these Lazy Man hooks are a uh, are a swim bait hook that's weighted and has a underspin on it. And like I said, it's actually it's perfectly positioned to where if they come up to that uh, spinner, they're going to get a mouthful of hook as well. So. Uh, that's what makes these a lot better than the others out there. Um, but this, this video is something different. I figure, well, what's better than just one lazy man? How about five of them? So I went to uh, the uh, Cream Lures website and I got this, uh, this uh, umbrella rig for $10. So if anybody's looking for a cheap umbrella rig, hey, Swing by their website, pick one up, uh, $10, that's hard to beat. And uh, I talked to Robert uh, with Lazy Man Hooks, and I asked him, you know, I was like, oh, well, you know, they've got you know, a few selections and sizes and weights uh, just so the hooks are balanced and they fall vertical and, and uh, work as good as they can. And uh, I asked him, well, what size would they recommend for the uh, for an umbrella rig? So he went ahead and, and, and made me up some special for them a little bit smaller weight because like I said you had five of them plus the lead head on the umbrella rig itself and you're talking about quite a bit of weight so uh, we're gonna get this thing rigged up and see how it looks Like I said, I went, I went over to the Cream website and then got one of these $10 uh, umbrella rigs and called uh, Robert at uh, Lazy Man Hooks and asked him what he recommended for a, uh, for a uh, umbrella rig and this is what he came up with. Man, that's pretty. Can't wait to give it some action. Heading up to uh, Lake LBJ next weekend. We'll see how they do. Now I'm just waiting on my new Dunamis rod to get here. Uh, went ahead and talked with Josh over there at Dunamis and he's got me a, a nice rod just for these umbrella rigs to throw. So, and uh, they gotta be pretty beefy to handle all this weight and, and nothing beats the uh, Dunamis uh, lifetime warranty. So if the rod does break, hey, I can turn it in, get a new one, no questions asked. Now this umbrella rig, you can see I've got uh, three screamers that are one color and two that are a different color, as well as I've swapped out the, I've got uh, two different color blades as well, just to kind of give it some difference and uh, hopefully help find out what the bats are keying on when they hit these suckers. But uh, like I said, I'm excited to give it a try, and hopefully we'll have something uh, you know coming up soon with some results. So uh, I appreciate y'all uh, watching this. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, go ahead and do so. And uh, if you don't mind, give me a thumbs up on this one. And if you got any questions, leave them in the comments. Uh, I'm pretty active on the comments, so you'll hear something quickly. But uh, I'll see y'all next time. Catch you later. Bye.